Hi, I have a question for you today. Why are you doing what you're doing? Why you do what you do? Your mind will bring reasons for that, but here the exercise that I would like to propose is one that is more of an emotional nature and uh, of uh, really going deeper into assessing what is it that is not your mind consciously that might be driving your behaviors in doing what you're doing. Although this seems kind of uh, almost a trivia for some, take a step back from that and really assess that because there is a lot that this question can reveal within you without you trying to find justifications with your mind. So if you just pay attention to the emotions that come up while you do what you do, then you can be very surprised by that in ways that you could not ever imagine. Is it joyful? Is it loving? Is it kind? Is it peaceful? Is it uplifting? Is it encouraging? Is it fun? Why you do what you do? How do you feel? And before doing what you do, how do you feel about it? Are you joyful before you do it? Or you force that? Are you peaceful before you do it? Or are you forcing that? If you're forcing yourself, then it means that you are trying to get something from that, what you're doing. You want other people's attention, so then you feel love. Or you are doing that because then you will feel joyful. You do that because then you will be acknowledged. Then you will be recognized. But what if you recognize yourself first? What if you love yourself first? What if you be peaceful within yourself first and allow things to just come along, the activities to just start to take its natural course, their natural courses. With no push. And yet an energy is applied into that that you do naturally because you're a conduit anyway
So what are you allowing to be a conduit of? Are you a conduit of joy in what you do? Are you a conduit of um, fun in what you do? Make yourself those questions. And the revelation is here for you to do what you're supposed to be doing here. 